All right, everybody, we're about to do the fourth and final book review and giveaway from July 2021. Stick around. Hello, everybody. Welcome to Savage Flies. I'm Matt. Thanks for stopping by. So the book I'm going to review today is by Pat Dorsey. It's called Tying and Fishing Tailwater Flies. Now, a little bit about Pat Dorsey. He's from Colorado. He's been guiding out there for about 30 years. He's the Southwest field editor for Fly Fisherman Magazine. And he's got a couple other books to his credit, pretty much about fishing in Colorado and the South Platte River. But I think this book is his only one that's devoted mainly to tying. So a little bit about the book. It was first published in 2010 with the paperback version released in 2019. That's about when I got it. It is 196 pages, really good, high quality paper, big, hefty, good feeling book. Uh, beautiful pictures, well done photography, and he's got 24 flies in here. Well, 24 flies that he has the individual step-by-step -step instructions to. There are other flies in between some of the flies, so he'll have other variants. So I'd say there's probably a hundred different patterns in here, but 24 that you get the, the uh, exact detailed step-by-step -step instructions. Now about some of the flies, I would say they're pretty much all modern flies. You won't see a lot of 100 year old patterns in here. And by modern, I also mean from the perspective of the materials. He uses a lot of synthetics like a McFly line or vinyl D-rib, Tyvek or uh, glass beads or you know mercury colored glass beads. This is not the type of materials that they used 100 years ago. So let me just read you some of the flies from the table of contents here. You've got the Mercury Blood Midge, Top Secret Midge, High Vis Griffiths Gnat, Tyvek Betus, uh, Sparkle Wing RS2, High Vis Mayfly Dunn. So you can tell by the names of the flies in here that this is some pretty modern stuff. So how the book is laid out uh, with regard to all the individual flies, he's got a page or two uh, on the history and then maybe some of the fishing tips, and then a couple of pages of the very detailed instructions. Now, aside from the really cool flies and great instructions on how to tie them, he does have quite a few fishing tips interspersed throughout the book. I mean, here's a page on tandem rigs and how do you set up a two or three nymph rig. He's got a couple of pages on how do you build your own yarn strike indicator. There's another page on how do you set up and fish a dry dropper rig. So overall, it's just a really well done book. It's a pleasure to read and certainly very informative when you're trying to learn these new patterns. So who all is this book for? Well, I want to say this book is for everybody. A beginner could certainly learn some great tips and tactics on tying by following the instructions in here, but a, a very experienced uh, fisherman or tire is also going to learn some new tips uh, for using some of these more modern materials. And you're probably going to learn some flies that you haven't tied before. So at a cover price of about $30, but commonly available on Amazon for about $25, definitely worth it. I think it's a, a great book to have, and I think it's a pretty good addition to almost any tires library. Okay, before we uh, come up with a hashtag for the drawing for this book, let's announce the winner from last week's uh, David Klausmeyer's 101 Favorite Nymphs and Wet Flies. I just did the random drawing on that one, and we had 79 comments that used the hashtag nymphs, and the winner is Chip Blanton. So Chip, check your comment, uh, send me an email, and I'll get that book on the way to you. So to give away a copy of this book, just leave a comment. This time we're going to pick the hashtag Dorsey. That's pound sign, D-O-R-S-E-Y. Just leave that anywhere in your comment. Today is Sunday, July 25th, 2021. Next Sunday, I believe, will be August 1st. I'll go to the random comment picker and we'll select a winner and I'll get a copy of this book on the way to you. So that's it, everybody. Just my way to say thanks to the Flytown community. I appreciate your support. Appreciate you watching my videos. Y'all take care. We'll see you next time.